Hey guys, I'm Pete Freak. Welcome back to Borderlands, the pre-sequel, Claptastic Voyage. Claptastic Voyage? Yeah, that thing. Anyways, last time, we finished up some side quests here in the Motherless board, and then we went over to the Overlook memory, and it was apparently completely falsified by a new subroutine inside Claptrap called the Denial subroutine or whatever, and we had to fix all the memories, or go through them, and turns out that Claptrap is a big screw-up. We all kind of knew this. But after we defeated the subroutine, we finally were able to get access to Quarantine and open up Quarantine, releasing us the access to the H key, or so we thought, and we ended up releasing Shadow Trap, who turned out to be super evil. What a freaking shocker. Anyways, in this part, we are going to probably not continue the story at all, because we have a lot of side quests we gotta go to, starting with Id Trap side quest. So there's a little um, data, what they say? Data stream. Sorry, it's been a good couple days. There's a little data stream over here that we can take, and that'll help us get towards the area for the side quests, hopefully. We have some side quests that we all grabbed, but then we also have some new ones that we gotta, got, gotta get. Also, I should mention that I did do what I said I'd do, and I went ahead and... Uh, how are we supposed to... Oh, there's... Okay, I see how we're supposed to get over there now. Okay. I did what I said I'd do and I actually grinded up on the subroutine and got myself a couple more levels. Uh, real quickly, I'm going to show you guys my equipment. I don't remember if I got anything new. Or, well, I think I did. I'm going to try out this, if I remember correctly, and then I also want to try out this a bit more because this shotgun actually helped me a lot with the grinding process. But again, it's a level 19 uh, thing and kind of need to get an upgrade eventually. I also have this new shock laser, if I remember, and then... We, of course, have our SMG. And then I think we got some other changes, but they're not as major. Anyways, so this was the platform we were trying to look for the entire time that we need to get across from. And thank God for low gravity here. All right, so we got to get to the generator, which here we are. How do we get up? Oh. Come on. Die, all of you. Yes, you are. Ads or bugs confirmed. YouTube is full of friggin' bugs. Jeez. The amount of ads where it's like people being like, you know, you're probably gonna stick to that. It's like, yeah, of course I am. You saying that's not gonna make me want to get your product anymore. In fact, you give you having a freaking ad interrupting my video is gonna make me want to get your product even less. Ads in general are gonna make me want to get them less. I don't know. It just feels different during the time when commercial, like watching regular TV was a common place for me. And like the ads coming up during commercial breaks or whatever. Those were a bit more interesting to me, I guess, and caught my attention a bit more. Anyway. Enough being nostalgic and stupid. Oh, we're supposed to go right here. Okay. Springs! You go, Springs! We're supposed to get Springs? What? Where are we headed for that? Are we headed all the way back over... Nope. Where Where are we going for that? Oh, that's the opposite direction. Uh, Yeah, we're headed back over to the Nexus. Alright, I'll see you guys over there. Alright, so we're supposed to get these Springs or something. Let's see, where are they located? Oh, they're located literally just right over here. Okay. So, just below us, or... Yeah, just below us. Oh, I see, they're in the junk pile. Gotcha. How you going? You here for Id's Orbitron? How can anyone refuse that cute little fella anything? Ah, uh, that's great. I kind of figured it meant something like Janie, but... Okay, we're supposed to get an Orbitron? Didn't that thing completely screw you up or whatever last time? Whatever. Okay. We got your stuff, id trap. Now what? Uh, how are we gonna get back up there? Through the quarantine? We'll go down to the subconscious eventually, but for now... Like I said, tons of sightings. Pancake? No pancake. Alright, how are we gonna get back up there? Through here. Here we go. Alright. Can you please? 
I don't want your freaking ads right now. Yeah, these things are going down way easier now that I've actually leveled up a bit, so. Alright, here's your oil. I never thought I could be so disgusted by watching a robot get drink oil. Generator. So is this like Claptrap's gluttony? I guess. Then, here's your Orbitron. Oh good. The bear's still be getting paid. You helped Id Trap fulfill his every desire. Lucky you. No. I think that's enough for you, buddy. Okay, now that we got that side quest out of the way, what else do we got? We have a whole bunch of stuff around here. We're not going to be taking care of that at, at all. I think I actually spent my Moonstones to get some... Ammo upgrades, if I remember correctly. Alright, let's get the two that are here. I think I'm going to actually just grab all the side quests. Yeah, I'm going to grab all the side quests around here, and then I'll start do it, uh, doing them one by one. Hi, handsome jackass. Alright, what do we have over here? We have Super Ego. Oh god, it's this asshole again. Assist a caped crime fighter to rescue a damsel. Ego Trap, writer of wrongs and wronger of rights. I seek a sidekick to aid me in the dramatic rescue of a fair lady. Are you with me? Yes. Excellent. My arch nemesis, Rex Loader, has captured the lovely damsel distress and tied her to a train track, the dastardly fiend. We must rescue her and thereby earn her undying gratitude. Not that we heroes care about such things. <clears throat> Updating your echo with her location. Away! Yay! We get to help Claptrap's superhero ego. Awesome. Alright, and what's the other one? It's right, it's kind of far away. Isn't it just right on the other end of this platform? I don't have to go through the. Yeah, no, it's right, just right below us, right? Yeah. Right next to the junk pile again. Oh, it's your conscience. Hi! Asshole. Hey, Vault Hunter! I've got something I need doing! Noted. Have you got a song stuck in your head? Like, really stuck? You've got a weird looking first name. I like the size of your main train. I don't know something same, same with in street. What pain? I, ah, help! I can't take it anymore! Some earworms wriggled into my music library, and it's looping over and over and over and over and over. You've got a good-looking mainframe. Ah, please, kill it. Kill it before it becomes my new favorite song. <laughs> I get it. It's an act. It's got to be an actual worm. <laughs> uh, that's funny. Okay, so where are we going for those? So uh, we're going to overlook for both of them, actually. Okay, there's some quests we can get over in Overlook, but before we do that, we need to go get stuff over in the uh, Pandora cluster, so I'll meet you guys over there. Hey. Alright, it just gave a try with this uh, new SMG, and uh, yeah, I'm going to stick with this thing. Shotgun's nice and all, but I like its rapid fire. I just like this. I just like guns that have rapid fire and stuff. Can you blame me? Although then again, I play shotguns over in Under Dead, so... Interesting little dust devil. Don't shoot or run away. Didn't mean to spook you. I just, well, I really need someone's help. Okay, sure. Uh, where do I go to talk to you? That's a big ass exclamation point. Do I literally, okay. Please? How, how am I supposed to do this? Oh, okay, I guess I can just climb through here, so that works. Minak needs help in becoming accepted as part of Claptrap's cannon. With the cannon. <laughs> okay, sure. I'm a memory from a rather 
difficult period of Claptrap's history, and he's not letting me integrate. If I could become a happy memory, one that didn't try to literally kill all living things on Pandora, the system could integrate me. Will you help? A death machine seeking redemption. Count me in. First thing, I want to replace my enormous turret of death with something that says fun and friendly, not dangerous and homicidal. <gasps> no, would it be great if I could shoot bubbles, not bullets? Go grab a basketball hoop and some detergent from around Firestone. Okay. I get it. So this is, I believe this is a reference to the um, Claptrap Robolution DLC from Borderlands 1. I think that's the final boss you have to deal with. All right, so I guess we're since we're here, let's go get all the things we need. Can I move, please? Thank you. Basketball hoop. And where's the detergent? Oh, of course, the detergent would be over at the meds place. Oh, yeah, washing machine. That makes sense. All right. Great, you got the goods. Let's make some fun bubbles. But first, check this out. Run, run, murder time deployed. I'm kidding. In fact, I want you to obliterate it. Uh-oh, talk about full frontal, right? <laughs> I think that's an indie window. Oh, this is going to be so great. Give me that stuff. Okay, here you go. <laughs> wish the rest of me were that pretty. I am the most hideous shade of Hyperion Yellow. I found a barrel of paint, but couldn't, you know, fire the cannon and be in front of it at the same time. Can you fetch the barrel? Okay. I mean, I think you're a fine shade, but whatever. Those bubbles are kind of cool. And Ah, uh, they actually pop if you shoot them. That's cool. Nice little detail. Alright. Why can't I pick up the barrel? Oh. 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 This is stupid. I mean, I guess it makes sense. Push. Uh, you know, I kind of like, I like this um, memories personality, but I also, I don't know. They seem like a. Not far now. Keep going. They sort of seem innuendo each, sort of like Moxie, but whatever. Nearly there. Yeah, I can see that. I know how to look at a map. Alright. So, is this the cannon? Alright. Whoa! That is a funky looking cannon. Point that thing over this way, you crazy maniac, or I'll set my subroutines to murder! Ha! Tugging your tail! But seriously, aim it at me! That's a fancy ass looking machine. Or cannon. Where the hell did that come from? All right, as you wish. It's perfect. I oh wait, hang on. Uh oh. <laughs> oh good heavens, my combat program has been triggered. Hold them off until I can shut it down. Hold what off? Oh, these things. Okay. Shield activated. These guys seem mostly pretty harmless, so... Oh, yeah, I get it. Now I know why I like it. You need to destroy my turrets, but as soon as you start doing that, my combat programming will kick in again, and I'll try to kill you. <laughs> oh, I'll open up my first gun port, and when you're ready, start shooting the things off and try not to die. No promises, but okay. It's a very flamboyant personality. That's why I like it. It's a very flamboyant personality. I mean, that works too, I guess. Only two more! This is all so unnecessary. It's fine. 
If I was lower level, then maybe I'd be a bit annoyed. But... Okay, thank you. I appreciate the positive reinforcements. Yay! Now this one actually has the shotgun. The pistols. Yeah, the uh, pistol wasn't doing it for me. You know what? Let's actually show off the laser. I don't think I've shown off the laser. Alright, that wasn't too hard. Alright, let's climb back up on that, and... Okay. Again, I love how comically big the effects are. You've helped repress a dark and violent chapter of Claptrap's life. Nice work, Sigmund. Thank you. I'm finally a happy memory and can be integrated into the system. Claptrap won't have to be ashamed of me anymore. Mm. I can't thank you enough. I'm going to the ones to integration. <laughs> okay. Well, that wasn't too bad. All right. Let's grab the other side quest. Okay. I think I noticed the issue with the glitchy guns. Um... Yeah, suddenly this thing won't let me just like speed, won't let me just rapid fire anymore or something. Uh that was strange. Uh, whatever. Yeah, I guess it could be worse. It seemed to get fixed with just quick reload. So. Alright. Okay, quest is right over here. Yo, Shit. hey, yo, over here. You, you want to help a poor cookie out? Oh, they're cookies. The f okay. Descend into the depths to find de a devil in the dark. Me and the boys here are uh, entrepreneurs like. Make our dough digging up tasty personal data chunks from our host unit. Sure, we shouldn't be here, but that's just how we do. But now, there's some crazy I don't know what down there sick enough to try to make a meal of us. You look like you could hold your own. How about you do us a solid and see if you can't rip that thing a new one? I'll see what I can do. Friggin' A, for reals? That's awesome! Just follow the crumbs, and they'll get you where you need to go. Okay, then. I get a cookies, like internet cookies. He left that trail. Dragged his own broken self all the ways out here to us. Crumbs ripping off him the whole way. Just so he could bite the big one out in the light. Guy was the best of his batch. I'll miss him. Okay then. Whatever you say, bud. Into the mines we go. If you happen to find any data files down there, do me a favor, will you? And, and bring them back? Sure, hey, I guess. Keep your weapon ready. You're sure as hell gonna need it. Ships data mining adventure. Provocative piece of private and personal data. Yeah, it's a reference to Aaron the Cookies. Okay. Sure, whatever. Why are they coming out of printer? I have no idea. That doesn't look. Looks like suspicious. you're getting close. Now you got two choices. You can be ready, or you can be dead. Oh, that's actually quite pretty. Kinda look kinda reminds me of um the Omnix in order in uh, Overwatch. Other than Overwatch. All right. That's the end of the trail, huh? Must be where Snicker D got the fatal bite. All right, security area. Me and the boys will come meet you. Uh huh. Sure. All right. Couple of Stop! This private steel files bad. Why are you here? Shame, huh? Okay, you just kind of appear out of nowhere. There's a guy up top says you've been killing his men. I'm investigating. This is what's been mistaken my team for food? You got some sick eating habits, buddy, you know that? We got rights! Cookies steal private files for money! No rights! Want blast something? Blast tasty thieving cookies! Don't listen to it! A guy's got a right to work, don't he? This thing's a killer and needs to be stopped! Alright, so we have a choice of either killing shame or killing the data mining cookies. We will get different rewards for this. I'm gonna see what the rewards are. 
Okay, if we kill Shame here, we get this grenade called the Data Scrubber that is always shock, has a low fu has zero fuse time, very slow travel speed, but it has uh, increased damage, regenerates grenade ammo, and also spawns homing shield boosters, which is interesting. And then if we uh, side with Shame, we'll get a pistol known as Hard Reboot, always shocked, and increased damage and splash radius. I'm, to be honest, I'm more interested in the pistol, so... Sorry, cookies, but uh, I'm hungry, so get over here. All right, for you, loot. One second. I'll delete your depths momentarily. Okay, where were we? Oh, yes. Don't worry, guys. I'm off to the big glass of milk in the sky. All right. Well, that wasn't too bad, I guess. Let's go meet back up with Shane so we can get our reward. All right. And as promised, yep. you've solved the mystery of the cookie-eating critters once and for all. You did good crunching on greedy cookies. They gone. Now you know talk about what you see here. I have a feeling that it has the mannerism supposed to be similar to Cookie Monster. I don't know. I haven't watched Sesame Street in a long time. It's not something I really actively watch since I don't really have children around me. Uh, hmm. Let's take it for a spin, shall we? See. Oh, that's... Okay, so it's a projectile weapon, not a hit scan weapon. But... Could be interesting. Alright, anyways, now that we got those taken care of, I think we're gonna head on over to Overlook to get our next set of side quests. Alright, so the two... Hey, just so you know, so you're like prepared? My music collection can be pretty intimidating. There's a lot tracks in there. I'm talking classical, jazz, rock, pop, folk, rap, various fusions, trip hop, musicals, a lot of musicals. I'm talking full rock and track, play with dance recordings, yeah. 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 you know, a lot of stuff you probably never heard of. Oh. So, warning, if your mind is wrong, it's not on me, you know? No two. I've got tracks from everywhere in the universe, and a bunch from unknown universes, too. I mean, I am all about <laughs> gotcha. Hey, um, if you want me to make you mix, just say the word. Always get to get exposed to new things, right? Just be ready, though. I'm into a lot of very complex atonal experimental stuff, and it's not for the faint of heart. Yeah, I get it. You're a hipster. Hey. Whatever. Alright, so we got this side quest over here, though. Who put it way up there? That's too high. Uh, huh. You're a nut, your current mission. Welcome to Bite Club. The first rule of Bite Club is tell everyone about Bite Club. Seriously, no one knows about it. Thing is, I can't reach the microphone. Can you go use that microphone? Leave it to me. Who put it way up there? That's too high. All right then, sure, whatever. I guess this is a parody of Fight Club. I've never actually seen Fight Club. I saw the opening of it, but that's it. Okay, sure. I guess a bunch of grenades just kind of blew up in her faces. Whatever. You know what? Screw off. So, what do we got here? Uh huh. Destroy my Martian zombies. And, eh. It's cool. We rarely ever get to actually see legendary guns, but. Oh, that, that actually could be interesting. I'll give it a shot, why not? We're replacing a bunch of guns, so why not? Alright. Great. Now go ahead and tell everyone about Fight Club. Go on. Down with conformity, tell them. There might be brownies, tell them. Yeah, uh, sure. Attention, denizens of this, uh, mind. Fight Club is in session. Sign up! Or don't. Your call. Now, we just wait for everyone to show up. Okay, was that it? Oh, there you are. You've got the rules wrong, you idiot! That's the second rule! First rule is no punching! Okay, that was stupid. This club is going to places thanks to you. Now that's the guy I want to be. Uh... 
Okay. Anyway, since Claptrap was so... Uh... What's the right word? I don't know. Since he wanted us to really... Since he really wanted to warn us about how cool his music is or whatever, I guess we're going over there now. 